Blocks AI is a built-in tool that will support your workflow by generating and editing functional widgets, code, and data for your apps. Get started by clicking the AI icon on the left side panel. Blocks AI supports your workflow in three key ways. It can generate a fully designed widget, edit the design of an existing widget, and also generate code and data. Let's walk through an example by creating an e-commerce widget for a jewelry store that cycles through jewelry currently on sale. Begin by choosing the Generate a Widget command. If you need some prompt inspiration, you can choose from the pre-written examples in the suggestions. Include key details in your prompt, such as the widget's purpose, the components you need, and the desired layout. Once the widget is generated, you can make changes using the Edit Widget Design command. With Edit Widget Design, you can add or delete elements, reposition components, and customize the styling of your widget. Check the docs for more details on what's possible. If you're not satisfied with any of the generated results, you'll also be able to make manual edits freely at any point. Now that you've settled on a design for the widget, let's make it more dynamic by adding code and data. Describe the functionality and flow of events you'd like to see, such as connecting to the collection and configuring the button to cycle through items. If possible, reference any relevant element IDs, APIs, or collection fields. The generated code will be automatically applied to your widget. Blocks AI can also manipulate collection data. In this example, you can use it to generate a collection and populate it with data. Include relevant field names and types in your prompt for best results. You can always click Undo to revert any changes in the code, data, or widget design. And just like that, you have a fully functional, data-connected widget. Blocks AI is here to support you at every step. You can also use the Edit Widget Design and Generate Code or Data commands on any of your existing widgets. Keep in mind, if you are modifying an existing widget, make sure the right widget and preset are selected and in view before prompting Blocks AI. For more tips and best practices, check out the documentation linked in the description. We'd love to hear your feedback and to see what you're building. Join our Discord community and follow our channel for more updates.